Alright everyone, I'm coming at you with a pretty exciting Mattel video and you can see I've got the Lost World Jurassic Park logo up on screen because this is a Lost World Dino. We now, uh, I guess we're soon going to have all of the sauropods from the Jurassic franchise. So yes, if you haven't figured it out already, this is most likely the Memengi Saurus, uh, which was only seen for a brief couple of seconds in the Lost World Jurassic Park. This image was founded by Dino Mike Mac and shared to their Instagram. So extremely cool to see. I mean, wow. Uh, it, it looks like it so far. It's got uh, the ball joint on the head, so that's extremely cool. You'll be able to move the head all the way around and... Some people may be questioning, is it Memengi Saurus or not? I mean, it's kind of got the face that looks like it is, you know? And the, like, holes near the ears and stuff. So, you know, that was uh, thanks to Luca on Discord. And you can find them on Twitter as well. But yeah, bunch of things that just say this is most likely Memengi Saurus. I mean, we do know there could be possibly other th sauropods that could be but i mean it's kind of got the pattern of a brachiosaurus you know which i mean kind of did share that brown pattern you know you can see it in this photo here the memenchi source has a very similar pattern to the jurassic park brachiosaurus and just in case you are saying it might be brachiosaurus well you can see the nasal area the nose part it's really extended on brachiosaurus which kind of leads me to think how flattened it is it's definitely going to be memenchi source right so good find by dino mike mac i have no idea how you would get a hold of a picture like that but it's happened before with like scorpius rex and all of that so you know here's more brachiosaurus photos just to say but speaking of brachiosaurus uh a while ago was founded we could be getting a Jurassic World Hammond Collection Brachiosaurus. That's going to be expensive. Very, very expensive. Uh, so, yeah, but we know there's definitely more Hammond Collections than what we have seen with pictures already. Uh, w there's still a herbivore and carnivore yet to be confirmed. And one may be a T-Rex. And then... You know, Toyopolis has kind of hinted at this. They're kind of hiding, you know. it. They've shot down every answer. They would say no if you got incorrect. But they're kind of like not being very specific, you know. When people asked, is it Buck? They're like, oh, I don't know. They're not saying no to it. So it is very most likely we are getting a Buck Hammond collection. Would be super awesome. I know there are a lot of b brand new Buck fans after Dominion. So yeah, there's that. And... Also, uh, oh, what about a Stegosaurus? Well, they didn't say no to that either. So we could be getting a Lost World Stegosaurus. At least I hope it's a Lost World because they have been focusing on older Jurassic Park stuff with the Hammond Collection line. You know, we got the Jurassic Park 3 and Kylosaurus instead of a Jurassic World style and Kylosaurus. So it would definitely be very awesome. So, yeah, there is four possible toys to look forward to. Uh... Maybe a Memenchi source, maybe a Hammond Collection Brachiosaurus, maybe a Hammond Collection Buck Tyrannosaurus Rex, and maybe a Hammond Collection Stegosaurus. But yeah, now we can complete our Mattel Sauropod collection of Brachiosaurus, a Patasaurus, and Dread Nordus as well. So that is extremely awesome. We can add Memenchi source to the four canon sauropods. But technically, there is another sauropod in the franchise which is only seen as a baby, and it's a sculpture in uh, the Lockwood Manor. It's not Brachiosaurus, because we already have a baby Brachiosaurus, but it is actually the Diplodocus. We did get a mini Mattel Diplodocus, but never a big figure for it. So it makes you wonder, could we be getting that eventually? Would be very cool to see. We have, uh, you can search up on Google probably, Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom Diplodocus. But yeah, besides that, Here's the rest of the Hammond collection confirmed for 2023 and whatever. Male Velociraptor, probably one of my favorites. Uh, I'm not sure how cool it is. We haven't gotten too many images of it. Just that one image there and the image of it in the box. But some people have gotten a hold of the Concavenator already and it looks amazing. You can actually turn the head on it unlike Ceratosaurus, which 
falsely advertise that you could. But, uh, yeah, a lot of exciting things. Uh, when it comes to the boxes, there are different styles. So the Ankylosaurus has the 30th anniversary logo. Same with uh, Pachycephalosaurus. I believe what the Geostone Bergia does as well. So, you know, these are definitely going to be Jurassic Park style creatures. And it would make sense if we're getting Buck, Brachiosaurus and Stegosaurus for this. The Concavenator, it's a Jurassic World thing, so it's not. And people do already have their hands on it, you know. It's 2022. It's almost 2023. But, you know, I believe Concavenator was meant to be like a late release for this year on Amazon or something. But yeah... Jurassic Park 3 male Velociraptor does have that logo. However, the uh, female one does not. It has the Jurassic Park 3 logo instead. So, I mean, obviously they're meant to go together, the male and female raptor. So, there is that. But I feel like the female raptor will be rarer and sold in more exclusive kind of stores, you know. But, yeah, I mean, what are you, your thoughts which one are you most excited for? There's so many toys covered in this video. And I've got another Mattel video to make tomorrow, which I'm a bit late on, but I figured I'll still make it anyway. So yeah, let's uh, list them all right now. What is there? Mementisaurus, Hammond Collection Brachiosaurus, Hammond Collection Buck, Tyrannosaurus Rex, Hammond Collection Stegosaurus, Hammond Collection Geostone Bergia, Hammond Collection Concavenator, Hammond Collection Female Velociraptor, uh, Hammond Collection Jurassic Park 3 Ankylosaurus, and Jurassic Park 3 Male Velociraptor Hammond Collection, and then Hammond Collection Pachycephalosaurus. So wow, we're going to have a really big lineup of Hammond Collection toys for 2023. Yeah, once again, let me know what you're excited for, like, comment, subscribe. What would you like to see in future for Hammond Collection? I know I'd love to see Spinosaurus. Anything, like, of the big carnivores would be really cool, you know? So, say, Indominus Rex, Giganotosaurus. Therizinosaurus would maybe be cool. Uh, what else is there? I'd love to see... What would I love to see? Maybe a Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus would be awesome as a Hammond Collection, right? Imagine that. Ooh... What else? Oh, there's so many possibilities that you could have, right? Because, yeah, I mean, oh, Allosaurus would probably be a good one. Uh, but, yeah, hope you guys really enjoyed this video as much as I did. I'm super excited for that Mementisaurus. Glad we got a teaser of its face. But, uh, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Bye, everyone.